Hey what's up everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how you can fix dev error 6068 in Call of Duty Modern Warfare um, if you have an NVIDIA GPU. So I have the NVIDIA 2080 Ti um, and I've been getting this dev error quite a bit lately. There's nothing wrong with my computer, there's nothing wrong with my hardware, um, there's nothing wrong with the software. Um, well there kind of is something wrong with the software, we're going to update that and it should pretty much solve everything. So um, we're going to need to figure out how old our drivers are to begin with. Um, so to do that, go to menu, uh, the start menu, type in device manager, and go to display adapters. Right click on the NVIDIA graphics card that you have, go to properties, go to driver, and just take note of this driver date. Um, so mine's 62120, um, so, which is obviously fairly new. Um, that's only a week ago. So. I already did this fix uh, to get the latest drivers and I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So go ahead and go into your web browser and go to nvidia.com slash download slash index.aspx. I'll have a link for that in the video description. And then basically go ahead and sort through and find your GPU. So I have the GeForce 20 series 2080 Ti. I'm running Windows 10 64 bit and we want the game ready driver. And all you have to do is go ahead and click search and it'll show you the latest driver available. So you can see release date um, 2020, the sixth month of the year, which is June and then 24th, um, version 451.48. So I was coming from version 447 or something. So that's, you know, four version numbers behind. Um, so let's go ahead and download this driver. And we'll go ahead and click download. And it should take a little bit, it's about a half a gigabyte, so it should take a few seconds to download. Alright, once it's done downloading, go ahead and open it up. Choose OK. Okay, so here's the installer. Um, so it's gonna ask us if we wanna do just the driver or if we want GeForce Experience. I don't really want GeForce Experience, so I'm just gonna do just the driver. We'll do agree and continue. GeForce Experience doesn't actually improve anything at all. It's just kind of like a another game launcher, basically, and it can optimize all of your games for you and keep your drivers up to date, but I'd rather manually update my drivers um, just to avoid problems with the driver version. Um, and we're going to choose a custom install, and I'll show you why in just a second. Um, so here's where the settings are where you kind of need to pay attention. Make sure you check perform a clean install. Basically what this will do is it will fully take off the previous version or the current version, the driver that you have on your computer before installing the new one. So you're basically just ha going to have a clean slate, like a fresh install of this driver. Um, compared to if it just updated the driver, it would just you know change some files here and there, um, and it might not actually fix the issue. So make sure you actually do perform a clean installation. Um, I have all of these checked. You don't need to check some of them. Um, for example, the GeForce Experience, we did not choose that earlier, so it's unchecked right now. But you can uncheck the audio driver. You really don't need that if you have like headphones that you use or any other audio driver. Um, USB-C driver, that doesn't really make a difference. Um, PhysX system software, you can leave that checked. Um, that's a good thing to have updated. Go ahead and do next and do the installation. As you can see, I already have it, so current version 451.48, um, and that's what this version is right now. So 451.48 is a good version. If you update to that, you shouldn't have any issues with Call of Duty Modern Warfare, um, but there are there could be other issues with your computer that it's causing those dev errors so this isn't like a universal fix for everything but if you have an nvidia gpu um, this is a good place to start uh, it worked for me it worked for my friend so um, you know I, I hope this works for you as well so that's it for this video if you have any questions leave them in the comment section down below thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one